This video is for informational purposes only. It should not be used as a substitute for medical advice or diagnosis. Immediate percussion of the chest is the last step of the chest examination. It helps further evaluate any abnormal findings such as changes in lung density. In a quiet environment, place the middle finger of the non-dominant hand flat along the chest between two ribs while all other fingers are lifted off the chest wall. The other hand is positioned with the wrist in extension, acting as a fulcrum. The tip of the middle finger strikes the non-dominant middle finger on the chest wall. Start from the top and work your way down while comparing both sides. Three types of sounds are typically heard. A resonant sound is heard when normal lung tissue is percussed. A dull sound is heard when percussing over dense tissue such as the liver. A tympanic sound is loud and hollow. Percussion over an empty stomach produces a tympanic sound. A dull sound heard over lung tissue may suggest consolidation or a tumor, whereas a tympanic sound may suggest a hyperinflation disorder such as emphysema. Mediate percussion is also a useful technique to evaluate the extent of diaphragmatic excursion. The patient is seated with the back exposed. Instruct the patient to take a maximal inspiration and hold their breath. The examiner percusses downward until a definite change from resonant to dull is heard and mark this point. Can you take a deep breath for me and hold it? And relax. Now take a deep breath again. Now instruct the patient to breathe normally. Repeat the percussion technique and note the point where a change from resonant to dull is heard. Now just normal breathing. Perform the technique on both sides and measure the distance of the excursion. Normal excursion is 3 to 5 centimeters.